how to install the famous matplotlib library in python on mac os that's what we are going to do in this video welcome my friends to joystick we are going to first create a python project and then a virtual environment within it which by the way is going to take a few seconds and then we are going to install the matplot library within it this is the style that we are going to follow in this video because in the corporate it culture you are not allowed to install any package globally on a server so better we do it the right way so first we are going to create a python project to do that we will have to open the terminal so we open spotlight search using command space and then type terminal over there and then click on it there you go terminal is open you are free to choose the directory where you want to create your python project i am going to create it within the desktop so i'm going to get inside the desktop using the cd command all right i am inside my desktop here i will create a python project that will initially be a directory only which we can easily create using the mkdir command which stands for make directory so it will be mkdir and i'm going to name this python project as mpl underscore python consider mpl as an abbreviation of matplotlib which i made up just now that's it you can see the project folder has been created over here on the desktop now i'm going to get inside my project folder using the cd command and create a virtual environment which we can easily do by typing the command python 3 by the way I'm assuming that you have Python 3 installed on your Mac. If you haven't installed Python 3 on your machine, then you can do it by watching this video in the I button. It is very easy to accomplish. After Python 3, we'll write hyphen M V N V that stands for virtual environment. And let me give a name to this virtual environment as well. So it will be MPL underscore V N V. That's what I'm going to name my virtual environment. I hit enter and there you go. Virtual environment has been created successfully. Let's check if it indeed has been created by running the command ls hyphen ldr. And there you go. You can see mpl underscore venv, which is the virtual environment within the Python project folder mpl underscore Python has been created successfully. Now the time has come to install the matplot library using pip. You can check if pip is installed on your Mac by simply typing pip hyphen hyphen version you can see pip is already installed on my mac if you don't have it installed then you can watch this video in the i button which i made on pip installation all right let's install matplotlib so the command will be pip install matplotlib we hit enter and the installation has begun all right the installation of matplotlib completed so quickly now i'm going to check if matplotlib has been successfully installed in my project mpl underscore python or not another way to check if the matplotlib library is successfully installed within your project and your virtual environment is to open the python prompt which you can do by typing python 3 and then import matplotlib by typing import matplotlib obviously so this line of code not throwing any error is an indication in itself that matplotlib is successfully installed it's available within this virtual environment but we can also check it by typing print within brackets we will type matplotlib dot double underscore version double underscore we are going to close the brackets hit enter and there you go the version of the matplotlib library installed in this virtual environment in this project mpl underscore python appears over here which is again an indication that matplotlib is successfully installed within this project mpl underscore python with this we have come to the end of this video i hope you now know how to install the matplotlib library by creating a python project from scratch and creating a virtual environment within it do let me know in the comment section if you face any challenges related to the matplotlib installation i promise i'll help you i'll see you in the next video of joey's tech and only for this video goodbye and take very good care of yourself